Hey guys, Sam Morton from Tech Fusions here, and today I've got a quick review of the Jelly Bean Launcher for Android devices. So before I begin, I'd just like to give a quick shout out to our giveaway. This is five lucky people can win some software which is WinX HD Video Convert Deluxe software and basically what this does is let you convert different types or formats or videos to any format you wish so click on the annotation just on the screen there and it sends you straight to that video okay back to here we have got the Jelly Bean Launcher now this is just an application on the Android market and basically it just makes your phone look like it has jelly bean actually installed on it so let's have a look into it you got like the google search bar which is pretty nice you can move that about as you can see it's got these little crosses i don't know why but it's just giving you the guidelines of where you can move the actual widget so we leave it there unfortunately you can't move it all the way to the top as you can see there's like a tiny bit of a gap on the screen right there sorry it's a bit reflective if you see me oh hello but um <laughs> yeah let's carry on okay so yeah you can move the widgets like that um you can move these ones put them wherever as you can see it's got the nice jelly bean wallpaper i'll show you what other wallpapers they got we've got on jelly bean wallpapers here we go here's the nice wallpapers you got i don't know why it's lagging a bit but it shouldn't be the Samsung Galaxy S2 has a 1.2 gigahertz processor so it shouldn't be that way okay but they're just the ones it comes with in the application okay and if we look down here on this bar we can add up to four different widgets so I can drag and drop them into there simple so if we just do that the show boom boom like any other normal Android launcher does. There's the YouTube widget, and it is pretty good. It don't lag really. It only lags when it goes into that wallpaper application, which is a bit weird. But this is the first version of it, so we might as well get it. It also is free on Play Store, and I'll put a link down in the description for that so you can just go over to the play store and have a look at it there okay here's the application tray well grid whatever you like to call it and it's laid out like jelly bean so it's pretty good so you can just swipe through like that the only thing is I don't get why that is still the Android market symbol if anyone else think what's that about <laughs> comment down below so yeah you can just swipe through them pretty easy um, you can't actually order them which is a bit of a pain if you just press the menu button it goes back to here it says manage apps and you can go on your apps just there but apart from that you can't really do much okay it's got um, system settings so you can go straight into the system settings there change stuff pretty nice okay you can go into launch your settings as well and here we can change the desktop UI which should be the Android UI or phone UI or tablet UI not desktop I don't really get that but there we go um, there's the options I can cross air desktop indicator high status bar you got all other options there so it's pretty good that they included that and scroll speeds let's have a look at that you can change how fast you can scroll pretty nice um, system controls, user controls, icon packs so you can put different icon packs that you downloaded already or you can just use the normal theme icon packs okay you can reboot the launcher so if you press reboot the launcher it basically just boots it back up so if you're having any trouble with it as it's the first version you can just reboot it like that which is a pretty nice feature I think okay um, that's about it for this launcher I hope you enjoyed um, as I said it's free on the Play Store it's weird saying Play Store I'm used to saying Android market but hey ho 
yeah it's free on the play store so check it out it's in the description also check out our giveaway which will annotation just be there click on it and it will end on the 16th of July 2012 so and while you can this was Sam Morton from Tech Fusion please give it a thumbs up if you like this video and I'll see you in the next one please comment like and subscribe thank you